this is my greenhouse project it's a hybrid uh, solar uh, rocket stove mass heater type project uh, that was the uh, pool solar water heater 60,000 BTU those are the the PVC tubing that's I'm using uh, since we're in northeastern Ohio we, in the uh, snow belt there's a rather strong structure that's my fish tank it's gonna be aquaponics as well possibly depending upon uh, several factors it's I'm changing things as we go along here we go oops pumping some water into the fish tank uh, using the solar powered water well that uh, I managed to put together using used Mercedes auto parts available from Ben's Bones biz on eBay and that's the water that's being pumped from the well uh, through the hose the uh, construction of the uh, PVC tubing uh, you saw some remnants there because I ha don't have the horizontals in other well I have the first row there okay here's uh, some more pictures that support for the sides and I use that great stuff expanding foam to secure the PVC to the wood frame Here's another video that incorporated. Uh, you can see the uh, structure. The top of the PVC is supported by the 2x6, double 2x6. And we're constantly adding water. It's a 750 gallon uh, catch basin uh, that I was able to purchase for 30 bucks from a public surplus auction.com. A little plug for them. Now, next time it should probably be 100 bucks for the thing. And, uh, no plumbing yet and as you can see it's got my grapefruit tree in the ground at least in there and I started adding the size for the plastic and uh, oh we got some snow and boy did it snow and I don't have it covered yet there's the cover not inflated there's the fan that inflates it and now look how nice the outside of the greenhouse looks inside is a little steamy and and smoggy because of all the snow and rain that was melting a grapefruit tree is in the ground. That is, I moved the pump. That was just a temporary setup uh, to see how it would work. Because I have the water covered uh, with the bladder with some plastic so that uh, to try to help keep down the humidity because it gets way too humid in there. And this is the rocket stove mass heater that I'm using to heat uh, the additional heat for this cold uh, climate that we're in over here. Uh, there's a insulation, the four inch stack in the inside, old propane tank burning. I'm I'm burning sawdust, and that's me making the cob. Uh, and that's uh, getting close to where we're at at this point in time, as far as the project goes. There's my beehive.